Make not. a perception check. Can I use my hero point? <laughs> if you really, really want to. No. That's at least a... Uh... What's perception at? Imagine not a trip over your own piece. Six. Six. <laughs> It's a lovely day. Yeah. So I'm going to head towards the dock house. Right. Uh, the dock house um, is at the main dock building. It's a small side building for people uh, like when uh, crews come in on boats and they just need to stay a couple days and then mm -hmm. leave. Uh, the captains will probably go to the inn and have a nice time, but the crew is usually just spunk down in these. And it looks like it also serves as a makeshift a house for people who are looking for work and a little more down on their luck. Maybe don't own anything in Sandpoint. And working towards that. Um, do you go in? Yep. It's it's just a low one-story building. It's got a couple windows, and it's mostly just built conservatively and plainly. So I'm going to head in and <clears> begin <throat> looking for... To, I didn't even get where, to, what bunk he slept in, did I? Nope. I'm going to look for anything that's left behind. All right. Anything that's not tied down. <laughs> You're out of luck, because the thing is covered in hammocks. Everything is tied to the wall. I'm going to, like, to the ground. <laughs> Literally, I cannot pick it up. <laughs> you you come in and it's just rows of there are a few cots to one side and they look more um they look well kept as though they haven't had anybody staying in them and there are quite a few rows of hammocks and in the back you can see some like large storage bins and you know it looks like it's a place where equipment might be kept as well if there's not enough room elsewhere. Uh, you see various things just lying around like scraps of clothing, a couple plates of unfinished food. Uh, some boots. There isn't anyone in here at the moment, though. I'm can I make a thorough check? Um, just literally looking for anything that's of Tian origin or that I would recognize as being a tool of his, or etc. <clears throat> mm. I can imagine one of the hammocks just littered with shitty glass blown bottles. <laughs> <Mom. laughs> Him. All of them broken and jagged, so whoever lays down there, he gets the last laugh. Um, I'd say... Oh, jeez. What would that be under? Well, I could take a 20, but I would assume that... Uh, <coughs> You'd be taking... What is it? Not an hour, is it? I can do it. Hold on. <clears throat> well, I mean, I can't... I don't know if I can do it. I just know how to look for it. I think it's hours on difficulty. 86. Well, it doesn't really fall under perception. No, it does, because they alert, they, they loop search and perception. No. <clears throat> From I always five. think of perception more as finding... So... I'm, I'm, I'm conflating it too much with... Uh... Taking 20, you have plenty of time, and you are faced with no threats or distractions. The scheme being attempted carries no penalty for failure. You can take 20. In other words, if you roll a 20 enough times, eventually you'll get a 20 instead of rolling a d20, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, Tim. Taking a 20 means that you are trying until you get it right and assumes that you fail many times before succeeding. Taking 20 takes 20 times as long as a single check. Mm, I'd say... Two minutes for a skill that takes one round or less to perform. I mean, it's not too hard to go up and down the hammocks and see how many of them are occupied or unoccupied. So I'd say, yeah, you could take 20 and it would probably take you a few minutes because you, you're you trying to be thorough. And there are quite a few bunks and hammocks in here. Um, do you want to search the bunks or the hammocks first? Um, hammocks. And I want to search the, the cargo as well at some point. Okay. So you make your way up and down the hammocks. Most of them are... Uh, you know, they're not, you know, the most hygienic looking things, but they're functional. Uh, they look like they've seen quite a few people resting in them. Um, you don't find anything particular of note. You find some more scraps of food, uh, some cloth, a few discarded boots, some various assortment of fishing and sailing equipment that looks like it's just been left around. Uh, just small things people would have on themselves. Um, you don't find anything of interest in the hammocks. Uh... Storage containers are, at the moment, largely full of excess festival stuff that looks like it was probably decorated. They used to decorate the docks, and it's just been thrown in here because there's nowhere else for it. Uh, and that leaves the cots. 
Um, you go up and down the cots. Most of them look like they've been uh, slept in recently, but there are a few that are tidied up. Um, underneath one of them, you find uh, a few broken glass poppers. Shut up! It's cold. Incoming gif. <laughs> How old are you? Twenty-seven. Us. Oh, my character. So no, I was oh. I was going to make a joke he about worked, something, but <laughs> he he worked. Yeah. Yeah. As far as your character's know. fifteen. We worked as far as we know, as far as we know, for the Kaijutsus. That's the most recent information we have, and it has the most backing. It was a bad worker and was sent here, was here for a little while, and then three days ago left. I'm going to... You want to search the cut anymore, or are you done? Yeah, I'll search the cut a little bit more. So as you rustle around in it, um, you can find it hasn't been slept in for a few days. Uh, it seems maybe it was reserved for talk in particular, if uh, that was who left these glass baubles. But it's pretty narrow, pretty narrow uh, field of who would be carrying around glass baubles. That seems to be reserved for a particular sort of male man from a uh, faraway nation. <laughs> you do find a couple scraps of paper with what looks like. Uh, scribbles on them. Um, like one of them has been water damaged and is illegible, but the other seems to have some sort of uh, writing on it. I will attempt to read it. Make a read check. What's that? 12? Uh, 15. Hold on. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. 12. Ah, <laughs> it's got legs! Get a cup! Um, so 13. 13 uh, linguistics. Um, I was bullshitting. It's, it's Tian. You can read it. <laughs> um, you just told me to roll. It looks like it's a... You don't do it uh, Why, all your rolls are jokes. Ah! Oh. There's still a lot of water in this water. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what's it say? Um, it looks like it's uh, part of a paper that's been ripped out, so it's not the whole page. Um... It says kaijutsu. Mm -hmm. It says uh, something about a impending project, although the phrasing makes it sound like it's not something that is on the up and up. Um, but part of the sentence is missing. Um, it also says something about uh, meeting a new kaijutsu and how um, this one is much more amicable and easy to work with than the last one. You're my family brother. You're Taka's brother? No. It says that she hasn't seen her, her brother in a year. Hmm. Okay. But the rest of the page is either parts of text or uh, the edges have been water damaged and you can't make out anything else from it. I'll hold on to it and wrap it up and go outside.